Guys, the chickens here bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we have a pretty huge upgrade to get accomplished here. So we're going to be upgrading Mr. Cannon to the maximum, uh, the maximum levels. So let's go ahead and get that going. I am going to have to get a screenshot of this, so I do apologize. So there we go. There's uh, one cannon going into the max level cannon guys so check that out we now have the cannon at level 22 uh i think we can throw out one more nice nice that's gonna help a little bit um so we'll get mr cannon out over here somewhere and i'll move these sniper towers around just so they're not uh free artillery food uh i don't know put it down there somewhere or something like that so i've uh, been using a lot of heavy zooka been doing a little bit better uh, rank is still pretty pretty low. I haven't been pushing at all. I've just been focusing on opening up chests um, for right now. And then once I get my base redesigned and everything like that, then I think we're going to uh, do a bit of a more serious push, hopefully, uh, at some point this weekend. So, um, yeah, I've been using heavies and zookas with battle orders, 4-4. Uh, it's been okay. Honestly, it hasn't been great. But um, since we have all the chests right now, uh, I'm just going to try to go for time here and see what we can do. I also recently unlocked Barrage, which was somewhat helpful. Um, and I'm hoping that our cannon upgrade on our defensive side can really help us kind of break through this wall that we've been uh, that we've been stuck at, unfortunately, for the for the uh, for the last little bit here. So we got um, we got the heavies coming through. Let's get one more battlers from Mrs. Brick. There we go. Um, okay, so he's got us down to two. I'm gonna throw a shock out here just to protect some of these Zookas, and they can take down a couple defenses for us. And let's get them, let's get them to just flare onto this engine room. Uh, I am going to throw an artillery back down here to keep the sniper tower off the Zookas. Uh, and then we can just go like this, and we can shock right here. And let's get one artillery right there. Uh, I should still probably upgrade those flares, but that's okay for right now, the time being. Boom. That should be a hashtag uh, chicken victory, guys. But we'll see. We'll see how the timer uh, how the timer runs out on us. Devil is still going in, in here. Um, oh, look at this, guys. Look at this. He barely took the base down. Well, I mean, he, he did pretty... Uh, he did take it down pretty well, but... Uh, <clears throat> either way, that's, uh, that's a good start. Good uh, start, I think. Boom. There it is, guys. Okay, so we got the first victory. Plus one. Let's get out of rank 13. What? Why did my rank not go up? Man, this game is so weird sometimes. I think I just won my last battle too and it didn't go up, which is kind of strange. Maybe I'm just infinitely stuck at rank 13, guys. That's what we'll go with. That's what we'll go with. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3. Okay, I didn't put any of them down. Um, okay, so let's go. Let's take out the shock mine over here. And let's go battle orders. And then I'm going to shock all three of these cannons just to keep the heavies nice and healthy. Um... Okay, we got in kind of a weird path there, but I think that's fine. Um, now, what I could do here... Let's get a little bit greasy. Let's get a little bit greasy, guys. We're going to flare them up here, and then this way. Uh, one, two. And then we're going to go uh, shock. Uh-oh, I think I shocked all the troops there. Uh, okay. Um, let's go battle orders, smoke. Ah, I don't know if this is going to work, guys. I don't know if this is going to work. we got to get the Zookas out. Oh, we just got rinsed by that flamethrower. Oh, man, that was so bad. That was so bad. I just panicked at the last second when they were all caught under that smoke. Hopefully, we can get at least two engine rooms out of this. Because uh, if not, we're not really going to have a fighting chance. Uh, unless this guy disconnects or does something absolutely disastrous, I don't see how we're going to come out on top of this one. Oh, okay, it's a bit of a chicken fail. bit of a chicken fail, guys. But sometimes you just got to go for it. Sometimes you just got to go for it. So... Uh, there we go. There is that attack. Uh, so we're gonna go back one. We'll see if the rank thing is working at least, I guess. And we have, uh, one more upgrade that we can do. So let's focus on that for right now. Now, we should get mines maxed out as well, um, before we start really looking deep into what we can do down here. Actually, let's go ahead and unlock troop damage. I don't think I'm gonna upgrade that just yet, though. I'm gonna wait on the second tier of, um, of nodes until I have most things maxed out down at this end. Um, and let's go with, let's go with, uh, machine guns would be helpful, mortars would be good. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking between machine guns, mortars, and mines. Um, mines are at level 12 currently. So, let's go with, let's go with machine guns. 
let's let's go with machine guns and then we just upgrade the mortars that was uh that was interesting for sure i i meant to click on info not on um upgrade right there but whatever that's okay we'll get another chest in in a few hours and then we'll be fine guys so um we're still waiting for the previous attack to finish uh we'll throw out our extra mortar that we now have uh and we'll throw him let's throw him just right about here just to kind of uh i don't know just to kind of make uh, deter some heavy zooka attacks coming up the front and uh yeah good stuff warships come on let us play for god's sakes uh but yeah other than that um like i said in, in the last video flamethrowers uh cannons should prove to be pretty helpful um I do need to, um, I do need to move around my base again to make the engine rooms, uh, take it a, to make it, to take a little bit longer to get through the entire base as opposed to them all just kind of being, uh, surrounded out at the back there. So, either way, let's go like this, and I'm gonna wait for them to hit those landing flags, and then we're gonna go up this way, I think, and let's go with a barrage right about here, and we're gonna go with a shock and a shock, and then a quick battle orders actually i'm not going to do battle orders because i don't want those zookas stepping those mines now we're going to come in with the battle orders that the zookas are in a bit safer of a position um and we're going to follow up with a second battle orders right here just as the first one was about to expire and we should be able to rip through this guy's base very quickly i'm actually going to save up for a third round of battle orders here in a second uh there we go okay and now let's get uh, a shock over this way keep those heavies nice and healthy and as soon as this uh, engine room goes down on the left, I think I'm just going to flare to this one right in the center. And we're going to go all artilleries in on that. One more flare to keep the Zookas, uh, to keep the Zookas nice and moving fast. There. Okay, so maybe getting greasy on the last attack. Not the best strategy, but uh, regardless, here we are, guys. Here we are. My ranks are not going up. Did we not just win there? I guess we, we lost and then won, but uh, something's not working here. Something's not working here. Maybe it's just the chicken. Let me know, let me know uh, down below in the comments if you guys have this issue before. Maybe I'm just blind. I don't know. I've been uh, prone to uh, to that happening before. All right. Let's go heavies and zookas up on the right side to start this off with. And we'll get a nice shock uh, going a little bit early. Uh, I used the battle orders back there. Not you know It's not the greatest spot to use it, but it does help them just get up because these... These, uh, the warship landing zones are just so long, uh, it, it can take them forever to get moving through it. So let's go like this, shock that cannon, and shock this cannon. That was probably a waste of combo energy, I would have been better off to save up for another, uh, battle orders, I think, but, uh, but that's okay, we are up, uh, one engine room so far on this guy. Uh, maybe that did save us. Okay, let's go, let's go, battle orders please, let's get moving, rock and rolling, clucking and ducking, uh, we're gonna shock right here, take out this machine gun, and come on Zookas, take down that cannon, there we go, uh, looking alright, looking alright, and let's go with a barrage right on top of this guy, and now we're gonna flare over here, and we're gonna go one more barrage over here, and this should, I think this should net us the victory, guys. We'll see here in, in just a moment how quickly he's going to get our last engine room down. It doesn't look like he's able to do it. So, the cannon's coming in a, a little bit strong, I think. Um, we got a bit of time, though, so we can go over this uh, this replay and see exactly what happened here. Um, okay. 100%. Okay, we beat him by uh, 5 seconds. Let's take a look at this replay and see how we were able to achieve this monstrous feat. Okay, so he's going heavies and zookas. Everyone's going heavies and zookas, guys. Everyone's going heavies and zookas. So he's just coming straight up the gut, it looks like. Uh, nothing too crazy that we haven't seen before. He's just shocking away at everything. Um, what I'm noticing, what I could do, is probably pull the shock mines a little bit closer. Um, so that's not as, uh, you know, so it's it just slows them up. You know when they're doing most of their damage opposed to you know towards the end of the attack when they're already sitting on top of the engine rooms and doesn't really matter um that they were more so put there to um defer like warriors and, and smoky uh troops and stuff like that but uh, hey there we go we moved up one rank after how many wins two wins equals one rank apparently but uh i don't know guys we're gonna keep it rock and rolling clucking and ducking as always uh as always thank you so thank you guys so much for watching that is going to wrap up the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And I'll see you next time. Guys, check it out, bro.